starts, four right, five left, good luck. Five, four, three, two, one. Go. Hey guys, Mechanic CG here. Welcome back to another video. And today we're back with another Asphalt Rally. Uh, this is the fourth episode of my WRC Moments series. Again, as you can see from the start, struggling with some of these corners. It's just uh, I'm not very good at asphalt, as you can tell. This one's quite an uh, enjoyable one. I believe this is. Spain? I think there's two Spanish rallies in there, so I'm not 100% sure. Four right, long tightens into three left short, and four left, don't cut, and late Corners are actually flowing very nicely here. Um, if you are wondering, we did have an issue with the uh, recording of the replay for this one, so there's no replay camera. So it is just this first person view, but I still have the raw footage at the end if you don't want the commentary. There's uh, speed limit signs shining brightly. This car's very twitchy towards the actual front of the car. Let me see. It's got the turning power, but it very much loses it after you initiate your turn. So you can see like the initial corner will go very quickly and then understeer throughout the rest of the corner. I do prefer gravel rallies, but you can't have rallying without tarmac rallies as well, so that's why we're doing all of these moments in order. And we've made contact with the barrier there, oh my god. That's uh, not a very good look. Obviously understeering into that barrier, losing a lot of control from the car here. From this point onwards, I'm in like safety mode. The, not push in. Definitely shifted down uh, too many gears for that one, so lost a lot of power. Here we go. Some fairly simple corners. There's a nice variety. This one may catch us out, and there you go, you see a little bit of understeer there, locking up those brakes. Surprisingly, the car actually seems to be controlling better on this track. These uh, junior WRC cars are actually quite good for getting used to rallying. They're a lot more difficult, in my opinion, than the actual WRC cars. And there you go, another understeering into the bank almost. Like, that's not even a bank, that's a rock face. That's the three quarter mark now, so just a little bit more to go. Into four right, one twenty. Two left, long tightens, eighty, slowing. Six right, half long, nice corner, and six right, right. Opens, into a hairpin turn. Side left, forty. Four left, opens, keep in, one hundred. Late, five left, short, forty. Slowing, slight right over crest, thirty. Two left, forty. Five right, tightens, three. Long, opens, forty. Slowing, slight right, ninety. Turn square left, Coming up to the end right stage side. now. One forty. Square left behind the barrel. The thing. It's five round. Left, half long, three hundred. Bail. 
That's the word I'm looking for. You see the 100 meter boards now. Final sprint to the end. And there's the finish line. 453.016. Not too bad. Quite happy with that time. Um, we obviously had the contact halfway through the stage, which has slowed us down quite a bit. And uh, this seems to be a little bit of a bug with that EAWRC. The card doesn't want to drive forward at the end. But uh, there you go. 4 minutes, 53.016. We're going to find out in a second if that was any good. Obviously, compared to the event, there's no one we're driving against, so it doesn't really matter. But in terms of leaderboard standings... 2,130th. Not good in my eyes. I'm obviously looking for a much better time than that. Top 1,000 is my goal. We didn't quite make it. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like, comment down below and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace.